good morning ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel more importantly though welcome back to yet another gameplay video here on the channel i'm standing here back at it again in tapping legends because we just had update 37 which gave us the halloween egg and now we're here with update 38 and they added a brand new egg to this little i guess halloween event here in the game so we have a brand new egg and it's called the ghost egg six new pets a new godly and a new exotic max pet levels is now 100 every level gives a plus one percent stat they optimize the game they adjusted multiple bug fixes and there's more updates coming soon but the main reason why we are here is because they just introduced trading here in tapping legends trading ladies and gentlemen now you guys know how trading goes with simulator games it could be very helpful very useful very profitable but at the same time there's a chance that there could be tons of scams awaiting you guys there could be situations where you're getting begged to trade and that's currently happening right now so i'm in server um, people can see that I'm like the second best in the server or at least the first best inside of the server. Either way, anybody at the top of the list, you're going to get spammed by the bottom of the list because these guys are, you know, either new to the game or they are, you know, established players, but they're not pros. Either way, trading has been introduced into this game. I want you guys to please answer this for me in the comment section because you guys know that I love talking with you and I love replying back to you guys in my videos. So I want you guys to answer this question. Do you think it was a good idea to introduce trading here in Tapping Legends? Now, you guys know that this developer has a second game that's currently open right now and it's called Oofing Legends. Now, Oofing Legends has trading in there as well. People been running around asking for Halloween pets because the Halloween pets are too expensive to purchase. And trading has been a success story in there. Um, not too many people are getting scammed. I had you know, I haven't heard too many stories or anything like that as of yet for oofing legends. But you guys know from playing all these other simulators, you know, boxing legends, boxing simulator ninja legends you know how trading goes and everything like that so people get hassled people get begged a lot and then you have the scammers you know people who pretend to not have something and then you see their inventory they have something and you ended up trading them your stuff and you can't get it back because you know that person doesn't want to give it back or they left the server so that's what happened um you know a couple minutes ago before i actually um started to turn on the recorder I was giving somebody a pet and this person literally ran as soon as he got the pet he literally left the server like if he was pulling off a scam or something like that like bro i didn't need the pet i gave it to you you know but yeah he ran off i gave him a toxic surfboard now i do have stuff available to you know help anybody out that needs help but at this point in time i don't have all you know halloween pets so even if i'm able to trade you you're gonna have to you know accept what i have in my inventory and just you know go about your business <laughs> because these two halloween eggs right now ladies and gentlemen they require a heavy amount of clicking the halloween egg costs one qtv and then you have the ghost egg which is the brand new egg 100 qtv and clicks so what I would suggest if you are really trying to farm this ghost egg or the Halloween egg, you're going to have to get your click game up, go to your best portal, stay there for at least like two hours and grind your clicks. Literally turn on your auto clicker. If you have the free in-game one, you can use that one. If you have the game pass, use both of them. And if you have a third auto clicker, which will be the auto clicker that you have installed on your devices, use that one as well. Use your ultra clicks and, you know, just work on your clicks. So that way you can come over here and get some of these eggs while you have the chance, because these aren't going to be here 
for too much longer. We're getting closer and closer to Halloween, also closer and closer to my birthday. <clears throat> but yeah, <laughs> these eggs are probably on a limited time situation, um, but not many people can afford these. So I don't know if this was a good update or a bad update, but let me just run it back. So they added trading and they added a brand new egg, which costs way too much. What do you guys think about this update? You know, now, honestly, I think the developer is under a lot of pressure because now you have a second game open and the focus is primarily on that second game but she's trying, he or she is trying to bounce between games. So if you guys remember Tapping Legends, it didn't have, um, it didn't have a update for quite a while. As I mentioned in my last video, I kind of thought the game was just, you know, presumably dead because it wasn't receiving updates because they were working on oofing legends. So now they decided to bounce back here and try to, you know, I guess, keep the pace together with both games it's going to be hard you know as a developer i'm not a developer but i'm saying you know as a developer for these games that have you know multiple games and everything like that it's going to be hard to balance it you know because you're going to have people asking for updates and oofing legends but at the same time you're going to be having those you know same fans who've been here since the beginning asking for you know updates for this game right here so it's it really comes down to you know your availability and everything like that and how much effort you put into your work but i want to know your thoughts is it worth it the trading is this egg really worth it if you guys were able to afford this egg let me know if you got the legendary i want to know what the stats are um i do want to show you the stats for one of the pets that i got from here um, I actually hatched two, but one of them actually got automatically deleted. Um, I'm going to trade this guy in a second. He's, like, really spamming me. But, yeah, I was getting spam traded like crazy. People kept saying YouTuber. I hate when people say YouTuber because my name doesn't literally have YouTube in it. But the fact that some of you guys are recognizing me, I love it. But at the same time, you could just say skills or berry like all my other fans are saying you know the new guys you guys are calling me youtuber like that's literally not my name that's a profession you know that's not my name but here is your comparison right here so we have the halloween duos which comes from the halloween egg this is the legendary 12 sx as a normal that's all we got we also have the halloween orb from that halloween egg 10 sx as a normal but this is your epic from that egg then as a golden we have it at 40 sx and then we also have it as a toxic as you can see right here but we have ourselves a ghost pet from the new ghost egg and this was literally the only pet that i could afford so this is your rare ghost hedgehog 14 sx now, I don't like the fact that this is literally 2SX better than this Halloween Duels, which is a legendary. Legendary should have a higher stat than your rare. I don't get it, ladies and gentlemen. But if you have pets, like I said, once again, let me know what the stats are. Basically, if you have gotten the legendary from the ghost egg, let me know what the legendary stats are. If you got the godly, let me know. What stats are for that and if you got the um, exotic also let me know what the stats are for that we have some buttons down here um, as you guys can see we have the trading down here there is also a radio button right here I don't know what this is for but I tried clicking on it nothing happened um, but what I'm assuming here is this is probably like some type of robux option um, I don't know if you can add audio sounds into the game, but, you know, radio jukeboxes basically are pretty much the same thing. So if you end up purchasing that, you know, just make sure you're not wasting your Robux. Um, they didn't add anything else in the achievements. They didn't add anything else in the upgraded shops. So it's just literally a egg. 
and they introduced trading. We're going to get one more since we can afford it now that we did our ultra click. And then we're going to end off this video because we're going to have to grind clicks to see if it's really worth it farming this egg right here. And we're just going to keep getting the same rare commons and epics. We haven't yet gotten the legendary. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please drop a like. Subscribe to the channel right now if you guys are new. And I will catch you all in the next gameplay video. Remember, if you want to be traded, you're going to have to basically accept what I have to offer and right now the best static stuff I can give out is the surfboards which are in Neon Toxic 48SX ladies and gentlemen I'm not giving away exotics because the reason is um, it took me so long to get these exotics you know I'm gonna be completely honest I didn't think that I would be able to you know hatch one of these things so when I was able to finally get them, I kind of want to hold on to them, you know? And this guy is going to just overload me with his garbage. I don't need that stuff, bro. I don't need any of that stuff, bro. And sorry if you guys were coming into the server and I'm just now saying hello. Um, you guys know that I pretty much talk in my videos. I'm not one of those mutes. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's give this guy let's give this guy these Pac-Man toxics right here. Let's really hook him up, and let's give him a 30 mil trophy. There we go. That's just some pretty decent stuff to give out. Um, but yeah, you know, if you guys really will want something, like I said, you know, you're going to have to take what I have in my inventory. Um, but yeah, this is trading here at Tapping Legends. This is crazy. And he honestly just gave away his best stuff. I'm looking at his inventory. He literally just gave away his best stuff. And there he goes. He's equipping the Pac-Man in the background. <laughs> <laughs> that is so awesome, bro. Enjoy those pets, man. I hope they help you out. They have helped me out a lot. So here's the exotic, this Nightmare Dan person. He wanted to um, basically show this off in the video, um, but he's over there AFK hatching. Um, this is your exotic from the Halloween egg. Um, he was actually supposed to tell me the stats, but he's AFK. But this is your exotic. This is what it looks like. It's not a oversized massive pet but it looks pretty cool the red color is nice and then just this this spawn area is really beautiful like this is the only thing that i legit love from the two updates so far this spawn area is really amazing you got these lights dimmed and everything like that it's dark you have this like fiery look in the air you got dead trees around the map this looks really really convincing to the fact of you know it's Halloween and as you guys remember you have a community board so um, every time you guys reach a milestone we're gonna receive you know um, a certain amount of click values so currently there is 25 million eggs hatched worldwide and as I told you guys in the last video this updates every 30 seconds so the more hatches you guys get, the more global multipliers we can get together, you know? So we got to kind of reach 50 million so that way everybody can receive this click multiplier, which comes at four times the clicks. If you guys enjoyed the video, drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and I will catch you all in the next gameplay video. Peace.